We had a fantastic week at our leading digital transformation executive immersion program. Let's learn a little bit more about what the experience was like. Uh, you've been with us here all week. I uh, want to hear just a little bit of your perspective on, uh, on this immersion program. Okay, so, so I think it's, it's pretty interesting. And uh, uh, so, so my expectation was that, you know, for a certain point, uh, we would be exposed to innovation and to everything that is happening in the Silicon Valley. But I think you guys really excelled in terms of providing us concrete examples uh, concrete practices, uh, benchmarks, uh, so, so it, it, it went much beyond uh, what I expected would be kind of, uh, you know, the innovation pitch that, you know, all those different cases and examples. That's good <coughs> to inspire, but I think, you know, most of the people that at least I, I see attended the course uh, was really focused on how can I make it happen back home. And, and I felt really you, you, you did a great job. I, I, I really have to compliment uh, you, know, you and the entire team because it was super great. I, I, I live very much satisfied. Of course, the challenge is still big, mm -hmm. right? So, so when, when you go back home, you know, all the different constraints you have, the business, the current business, uh, mm -hmm. uh, again, it's, it's, it's nothing easy. But I really feel like, wow, you know, it's, it has been enlightening so far. So. That's Thanks great. So I know you can read some of those inspiring things at home and then maybe you get your hands on a Harvard business case of how it was applied. How would that be different than ha you having actually come here and met directors in these companies? So I think in certain ways, if, if you have a, a, this kind of immersion, uh, first of all, you get more focused and, and you start to open your perspective in, in a week. That, that's why I believe you know, one week is enough and it's perfect because it's, it's, it's not about reading an article. An article you can read any time mm -hmm. uh, or you can watch a video. So th that's not the point. I think the point is, you know, how can you make up your mind in a much more comprehensive way? A and I think that, that was the, uh, what I, I experienced. Uh, you know, uh, so we combined a lot of different visits with a lot of different speakers, with a lot of different approaches. Uh, also, you know, getting closer to startups. So, so, so uh, all that gives you a different perspective about how you think about the subject. So, so I would say reading an article is really like, you know, more, it, it touches more your logic, mm -hmm. but it's very hard for you to get kind of compelled for action just because of an article. Now, when, when, when you start to see the whole ecosystem that is happening here and all the dynamics, and, 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 and all the knowledge that really already exists, uh, you start to say, okay, now let me think, you know, in this lecture, okay, what did I get? How can I apply it? Uh, so, so, so it's kind of translating in a much broader perspective. So. We know that, you know, your budget, but probably mostly your time is a very constrained resource. What do you, would you tell someone in your company who's maybe on the fence of, you know, making that time commitment uh, and budget commitment to come to Silicon Valley uh, to see what you've seen? So, so that was one of, uh, again, you know, prior to the course, I was concerned because it's, you know, this is not a super expensive course, but it's also not a cheap course, right? So, so it's, it's an investment. And, and, and always the question is, you know, did I, did I, will, I, will I get, you know, my money back or will I have a payback? And, and I'm not really thinking only about myself, but, you know, I, I mean, for the company itself, right? So, so would you foster this? Would, would you do it for all your team or something like that, right? So <coughs> what I believe is that it, it really paid off. So, so I feel like... Uh, there is a payback in terms of all the different knowledge that we got. Uh, uh, so, so, again, I, I would highly recommend, of course, it's not for everybody in the, in the organization, mm -hmm. but, you know, as, as we have seen, we had, uh, you know, certain uh, business uh, uh, entities coming with a larger group. So, so, so I think uh, uh, whoever needs to be involved in the decision making and, and, and maybe, uh, you know, in the process of leading the, this uh, transformation uh, to, to innovation, 
uh, I believe it's, it's, it's worth at least that you pick your key leaders uh, so that they can come, can have this immersion and can go back and really kind of, uh, uh, you know, take it to the other levels of the organization.